Hello and welcome to Lightworks. This tutorial is part 3 in the series looking at the new colour correction and blend preset modules. In this video we can have a look at using blend, colour correction and the corner gradient. We've got this quite nice picture of the girl sitting on the beach by the water side. We'd like to inject a bit of interest into it. What I want to do is add a couple of zones of tinting just fix up the image with a bit more interesting contrast to create a look. The look we're going for is like this. We're going to tint the top left of the picture in green and the top right of the picture in red. So we can warm up the right hand side and enhance the green of the leaves on the left. We're also going to add a layer of colour correction on top of all of that to further stylize the image. Colour correction is going to lift the whole picture, add some contrast and enhance the saturation in the blend mode gradient areas we've already applied. Let's go ahead and see how that's done. First of all, we're going to add the four corner gradient Right click, add, colour correction and corner gradient blend number two. Let's get to work. I'm going to turn off my colour correction layer for the moment. We're going to come to that a bit later. First thing I'm going to do is change my blend mode. I'm going to use overlay. Let's set that to about 66%. Next, let's work on the colours contained in the corner gradient. I want to work with a tint on the top left on the top right of the image. We're going to warm up this side with red and use green to pick out the leaves on the left hand side of the tree. At the bottom I don't want any colouring to have any effect on the picture. I want to keep the beach and up through the water nice and natural without any tinting. Let's eliminate the bottom left and the bottom right colouring. To the corner gradient section go to the bottom left and just pull out the alpha you might find it helpful also to drop the value of the colouring to zero. We might want to make some adjustments later working in that region but without any colouring. Bottom right, same again. Eliminate the colour and eliminate the alpha for the moment. You can see the beach is looking much better. We've got two distinct areas of tint, the red and the green. Let's set the colours of the gradients top left and right. First of all top left click the colour square I know the values I want 0 red, 158 on the green and 94 on the blue. And the rest of these values are OK. Next to the top right the red zone I know I want just red that's fine and all of these values can remain as they are for the moment. Great let's turn on the colour correction layer and enhance the picture further. First of all we're going to make some changes to the saturation I drop that down to about minus 7. I'm going to push the gamma fractionally, bring down the contrast to about minus 3.5, bring down the brightness to about minus 11, and lift up the gain on the whole picture to about plus 11. Now that's had a nice effect of adding some contrast, warming up the saturation in our gradient areas, but I like to lift certain regions of the picture further and put them back in so they're a bit brighter. To the colour wheels I'm going to lift up the mids to about 106 push in some warmth there by pushing into the reds to about there I'm going to raise up the shadows touch to about 105 I'll drop my highlights to about 88% OK, moving to the RGB tab. I'm going to lift the red gamma a touch and the green. I'm going to touch in the blue. I'm going to bring down the contrast of the reds to about minus 5. Straight over to the hue saturation value. The image is looking a bit rich. I'm going to pull away with the saturation to about minus 4. And on the scale, I'm going to push the value up quite hard to about 31 and a half. And there you can see the image coming back to life again. Nice and rich, plenty of contrast. We we'll go with about 31. One last adjustment over to the curves. I'm going to add a couple of points on the RGB curve. In the midtones. I'm 
first point I'm going to drop down put a little less curve in there and the second point I'm going to push up okay that's looking good and finally on the luminance curve I'm going to add a center point and just lift up the picture further just push back into the mid-tones there we go Put the green on the leaves, red coming through the green leaves as well, tinting them nicely, warming up the right hand side, nice glow around the sun, got detail in the clouds here. The beach is perhaps looking a little bit contrasty, so jumping back to the bottom left, corner gradient. Just going to work on a mid-tone grey there, see that here? Check the alpha. Just lift up the beach a little bit, bottom left, check the bottom right, same again, you lift that up a touch, check the alpha, just make that a bit more natural. And that's done. Don't forget to save your looks as a user template, you can recall them, apply them to other pictures later on. We hope that's helpful, thanks for watching.